Bismillah ar rahim So guys, we are back once again. So this will be the part two of my video series on how to create the scanner app using Android Studio. All right. So let's get started. So guys, as we have these two these two methods. Sorry. Okay. Uh, open camera and open gallery. Okay. So now what we, we what we will do is first of all we will open the camera intent. Okay. Through our library. So what can we do? So open your uh, library page okay i will upload the link in uh, the video descri description okay so now here we what we will do is first of all let let's see here okay so if you are if you are using android studio add the dependency to your main build.s okay as we have already done this so now what we can do in your activity you okay so here we have to copy this code okay copy it and paste it here and also paste it I paste it here okay so we have to import libraries okay so here we uh, what we need to change it, it is this preference okay so if uh, in this case we have open we have to open the camera so scan constant dot open camera it's all right okay so and in here what we need to do is we can change it to open media all right and all the code will be same except this one this will be 99 and this one will be 100 okay. and now we need to override the method on activity result okay and in here what we need to do is let's go here open it and here we just need to copy this code okay it's very easy you, you just need to copy paste Okay guys, so now here we will have copy. All right. So we will have this f is request code equals to. Okay, so we will have the same. It will also have ninety nine. Okay, and we can change it to 99 and result equals to result. Okay, so we need we need to get the URI and then we need to okay guys. So we we will have this and let's check the on click method open gallery and similarly open camera all right so let's run the code so first of all let me connect my smartphone since i have the api 24 so i will have to write the code for user permission okay so in this video i will not write the code but you have to write the code for runtime user permission okay so i will also be doing uh, a video series on runtime permission okay i will upload the link in my video description you can check from there okay so now our code is running but it will cause error because we have to okay so let me open side sync okay guys so now our project is running here so when i click on gallery and i select this image here you go so now we have this exception because we have not uh, we did not uh, allow it okay and when we click on the start app here we will have this error so now what you can do you have and you need to go to your uh, apps 
okay and here check my scanner tutorial Now the permission we will enable the permissions okay and let's run our app again okay so here we have this so we click on gallery and here I select the this image okay so guys here we will have we need to have the we need to crop the image okay so now what we can do we can just drag the edges all right and we will just click on next and here we have this image okay so we can change it to magic color okay and also we can change it to gray mode and black and white all right guys so uh, if we click on save button so the image will be saved all right so now the image is saved so if we want to okay so now i'll also show you how to use the camera so here we have we will have the camera okay so we, i take the image of my keyboard okay so here we will have the image i click ok and now uh, we can crop the image all right and if i click on next and here we can now scan our image okay if you like the video please like share and subscribe goodbye